piggies. Roasted meat. Come taste it. The Count Victor of Arl welcomes you all to the yearly fair of St. John. Enjoy goods from our region and beyond at the market. Make deals at our fish auction and try your skills in a free session of a shooting game. Tomorrow's event is the long-awaited cow fair. Get ready to overbid. The Count Victor of Arl wishes you all an excellent St. John's fair. I should check that stand. My stocks are getting low. Have you seen? What? The people here. They're smiling. Ah, uh, <laughs> it's true. Oh, look up there. The house with the weather vane. That's ours. Oh, right above the market. Yes, the view will be amazing. Rushes and comes from Firenze. Try them. My lady, why not change your hairstyle? Thank you, but I like it like this. Oh, good for you. A woman's hair is her righteous crown. Beautifully said. The hair is nice like that. Well, thank you, sir. Come on, yes. you can get him. Come on. Nicest trousers around. This is some really beautiful furniture here. I have a closet this wine. In my room. I like to hide it. He's dead. But he loved this wine. Oh, well, he was a very fine man then. He was. Thank you. Fresh from the cold. Help spurs. Mm. Look at the colours. Just imagine the clothes you can make with this. The most beautiful clothes you can be sure of. Are you interested in it? <laughs> I'm interested in too many. Roses. Oh, you know you're a barium. Only flowers. My mummy taught me. We kept them in a book at home. Do you want to buy flowers then? Thank you, but we like to pick them in the wild. It's our thing. I understand. Enjoy. Yes. Come, let's see the rest. Sure. Breakfast from Corsica. Caught this morning. Every four crates gets you a fifth for free. Come play. It's free. A gift to our visitors from the Count of Arles. A game? What do you say, lady? You look like a winner. Yes, she is. <laughs> All right. So how do we play this? You get four shots to knock down as many cups as you can. Got it? I'm in. Ready? Like the fur back home, Amicia. Easy. <laughs> yes. You're great. That was close. You hit a lot. Of course I did. What did you expect? You're our best player today. And you didn't even use your sling. I think we have to get going. Thank you. Goodbye, sir.
Ivan's parents must be dragons. A man dragon! Let's go see our house. It should be right up here. Oh, we can share my room if you want. Don't you want your own? Mm, I don't know. But that way we could invite each other to our rooms. Yes, I love this place. <laughs> Me too. Oh, they're playing music. Oh, I can't see. Hey, you know what? I'll put you up on my shoulders, all right? Oh, yes, please. Here we go. You're feeling all right up there? Yes, I can see everything. Stay a bit more. We'll come back. The people here, they don't seem to know about the bad things. Bad things? Everything that's happening outside. I think they do know. They just feel safe here. You will too. Hey, I'm going to put you down for a bit. <clears throat> oh, let's pick up the pace. Yes, I can't wait to see the house. I wonder how big it is. I just hope they have real beds. I hope I can see the market from my room. A king's room, of course. Of course. <laughs> Someone's had a long day. Hey, you're back. So how was it? They've got everything. <laughs> it's true. We'll have to go back all together. Sure. We need some fresh herbs. Look at that. I think we can call it home. Yes. Home. I haven't said that word in a while. I'm glad we came. <sighs> and I think someone needs to take a nap. I'm not tired. <laughs> sure. Let's go see inside. This is our door. Ooh. It looks quiet. And it's less hot here. It's nice. Ready to come inside? Yes, lead the way. We're home, Hugo. Our new home. Let's take a look around. Mm. Yes. All right. We'll do that later. Mother, where's Hugo's room? He's exhausted. Upstairs. The bed is ready. Thanks. Come on, you sleepy beast. Come, Amicia. Come where? The island. You'll be healed there too. Healed? Well, that would be nice, I'm sure. It will be. You're thinking too much. Sometimes it's better just to trust your feelings. I'm trying, but I... I get stuck in the logic of it. Substances obey natural law. The macula does too. You don't need logic, Lucas. You just need to be human. Maybe... <sighs> I'm just not very good at being human. You are. This is why you have doubts. Amicia! He had a 
Today must have woken it. We had six months of respite after he passed the second threshold. But the balance of his blood is very delicate. Amicia, go with Lucas. Magister Rodin is somewhere in this town. Find him and tell him to come quickly. Right away. Amicia. I know. We'll be careful. It's because of those farmers. I should never. Oh. It's not your fault. How can you be so sure? You can't control what happens in his blood. The macula keeps evolving, pushing the carrier through different thresholds. Will this Magister Vodan really help? The Order has been studying the macula for centuries. If they can't, I don't know who can. Lord, protect him. Vodan shown up already. I think he's just being discreet. The order works like this. Someone must know about him. Let's ask around. Here, a town guard. I'll ask him. Uh, hello? Excuse me. Would you know the whereabouts of Magister Vodin? Uh, I've heard of a Sir Vodin, not a Magister. Try the marketplace. There's a couple of florists there. I think they deal with him from time to time. Thank you. Good. That's a start. I should have known. Of course he doesn't go by his order's title publicly. We came by the florist earlier. It's somewhere around this marketplace. Hello again. Oh, it's you. Looking for flowers for the little one? Actually, I'm looking for Sir Vodin. I believe he's one of your clients. He's my husband's client. He's the one who deals in medicinal herbs. Oh. But Morton should be right by the fountain. Just tell him I sent you. He's wearing a brown tunic. Brown tunic. Thank you for your help. Let's hope he tells us. He will. Excuse me, sir. Your wife sent us? Now, what does she want now? I'm busy cleaning this mess. It's not for her. We must find Sir Vodan. Him? Well, he doesn't like to be bothered. Just like me. Listen, my brother is very sick. We need him immediately. Oh, all right, all right. I don't know precisely where, but I think he lives close to the arena, down there. Don't tell him I sent you. Don't worry. Thank you. Right. Let's not waste time. The arena district. That's a lot of houses. How are we going to find him? There's mischief in the air. I can feel it. Yes. It's a slum. The order's not poor, so what would a magister be doing here? Probably hiding? Probably. Amicia, that symbol on the wall. The order? Yes. He's in here. No one gets in. The arena is off limits. Why is that? Because the Count of Provence said so. Get going, please. Listen, I really need to pass. It's all right. Come. We'll go around the arena. <sighs> Now's not the time to argue with soldiers. Let's look around. You're right. Sorry.